Listen up, bro, and listen good, man. Listen really good, bro. Nobody cares. Nobody care about your situation. Nobody care about your problems. Nobody cares, bro. Not your friends, not your family. Maybe your dog, maybe. If you got a good, loyal dog like I do, they might care. But nobody cares, bro. The sooner you can pick up on this mentality, the sooner you can remember this, that nobody cares about what you got going on and everybody is more focused on their personal problems and their personal issues and their personal life. They're more concerned about that than whatever it is you going through. You will only be left with one person and one being. Yourself, you and God. That's it. And when you know that it's you that you have to rely on and it's you that have to get yourself out of whatever situation that you're in, that's when you'll start moving differently. But as long as you blame it outside sources and people outside of yourself or you expecting somebody to come and save you and come pull you up out of your situation, as long as you expecting that, you're going to stay right where you at because nobody coming to save you. You got to do the work, bro. I see so many people, especially young men nowadays, complaining and blaming their life on outside sources bro if you got the ability and mobility to get up and move then you responsible nobody cares bro nobody care about what you got going on life hard for everybody so if life hard for everybody why somebody gonna stop dealing with their hard life and come focus on helping you out of your hard life make that make sense as human beings we prioritize self first. It's just how we are. It's how we was designed. We prioritize self first. You're going to put what's in your best interest first. Or what you think is in your best interest. You're going to put that first. So stop expecting others or outside people to come and save you or come and help you out of your messed up situation. You got to get up out your situation. Soon as you can understand that as soon as you can adopt that mentality the sooner your life can change but as long as you expecting something else or someone else to come and help you and save you you're gonna stay right where you at bro nobody coming to save you and no one cares bro this is a harsh harsh truth that you need to hear you sitting here blaming everybody else for why you where you at bro it ain't they fault. And even if it is they fault, it's your responsibility to change your life, to change your situation. It's not their responsibility. If somebody did you dirty, don't expect them to come and apologize and make things right. They may never do it. So it's still on you to change your life. A lot of times you think that if you share your problems with others, if you tell people how hard your life is, how bad your life is, you think they're going to somehow magically come and fix it and help those situations. You think that's what's going to happen. No, they're going to hear everything you're saying, hear all the bad things. They might give you a few words of encouragement and that's going to be about the just of it because they got their own bad stuff going on, too. Or they may hear your bad stuff that you complaining about and they may respond with bad stuff that they got going on. So now y'all just two people sharing negative experiences, getting absolutely nowhere instead of talking about how you can change your life or how you can make a game plan to change your situation. You calling your friends, telling them how hard your life is, but you're not calling and saying, yo, we need to work on something where you can get up out the situation. We need to start soaking up games from people that are where we trying to get to. How can we get in touch or how can we get close to people who we're, that's where we trying to get to and see if we can soak up some game to change our life? But no, instead, you want to sit there and complain and talk about how hard your life is. They ain't going to do nothing, bro. It's not going to change nothing about your life. It's going to keep you right where you at. No one cares, bro. Especially if you a man. Y'all know my channel is directed towards young men, bro. So if you a man, you have to know this, bro. No one cares, bro. No one feels bad for you, bro. You a grown man. You got to change your situation. That's what it is. If you want to know how you can change your life, if you want to know how you can get yourself out of the situation that you're in, the first thing you have to do is acknowledge you are the one that has to change it. No one else. That's the first step. You tell yourself, I'm the one who got to get me up out of the situation. It's me and God, and we about to make this happen. Nobody else is coming to save me. I can't rely on my friends. I can't rely on my family to change my life and change my situation. That's step one. Step two, understand that you can do something about it. Understand that you can change your life. 
You can. You have to understand that and you have to know that and you have to speak these things. I actually can change my life. I can get up out the situation that I'm in. I can get to the bag and get some money. I can lose this weight. I can do it. I can put the, the Twinkies and the honey buns down and junk food. I could put that down. I could change my life and I could get in shape. I can do these things. I can change my mental. I don't have to be so aggressive and violent and angry all the time. I can do that. I can change that. That's the second step, acknowledging that you can do it. You can be the one to change your life. And then the last step, you start taking small steps to actually doing it, right? Picking up a book and read. Again, finding you a mentor, getting in touch with somebody that can help change your life. I'm always available. Hit me in the email, gamerlivebygmail.com. I got a Patreon. You can join the, join the Patreon. It's in the description. And even if you don't get in touch with me, but getting in touch and surrounding yourself with people that are where you're trying to get to, they have a different mentality. They don't have a negative mindset. They have a positive mindset. They have a do it. I'm going to get it done mindset. Not I'm going to stay where I'm at mindset. Surrounding yourself by different people. Picking up a book and read, changing your, your, your routine. What is your morning and daily routine like? Are you waking up early and getting to it? Are you working on yourself every single day? Are you striving to be 1% better every single day? Is this your routine on a daily? You start taking the small steps to getting to where you're trying to go. YouTube is here, bro. YouTube is free. It's videos on literally anything you can think of. Why are you not researching? You check your YouTube history. It's nothing but sports and gossip. And, and rap music videos getting you absolutely nowhere in life why don't you youtube some stuff that's beneficial bros people out here like myself and a ton of others giving free game on the internet for free that's telling you what you need to do to change your life and you still not doing that bro is no excuse this is why don't nobody care this is especially why me and like myself don't care if you're sitting there complaining and you're not taking no actions bro nobody is going to care because everybody can see what you're doing now, if somebody look at you and they see you've been grinding, you've been working hard, for one, you, your life will have different results. But then for two, they would actually be more compelled to want to help. But if I see somebody sitting on the couch playing a video game, not working, not doing nothing with their life every day, but then complaining, I don't want to help that person. You're not even doing, you don't even want to help yourself. Come on, man. Life is very hard, bro. It is. It's difficult. We get it. But everybody dealing with a difficult life, right? Everybody going through something, whether you got money or not. It's a million different things that could go wrong in someone's life. So everybody is dealing with something. So you're not special when it comes to being in a messed up situation. Because somebody else is in a messed up situation or maybe even a situation that's worse than yours. So crying about it, complaining about it and expecting other people to come help you and change your life is going to do nothing, bro. I'm trying to tell you, I'm trying to tell you the harsh, harsh truth, man. No, it might not be what you want to hear, but it's what you need to hear. If this video helped in any kind of way, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, join the Patreon, man, in the description below. Shoot me an email, whatever you need to do, man. Follow me on the gram, Game to Live By, TikTok, Game to Live By, it's all the same. I got more videos on the way, man. Peace.